Hi, I'm Salt Lake City Mayor Erin Mendenhall, and today we're calling out some of the incredible work that our Salt Lake City team did in 2020. And joining me from our attorney's office is Legal Secretary Heidi Medrano. Heidi, thanks for being here. Of course. Heidi has been a standout member of the team for a long time, for more than 10 years. And her leaders say that she embodies the highest level of professionalism and detail orientedness and her commitment is incredible to stellar work. So when 2020 called for many of us to work from home, like a lot of employees, Heidi had to manage the challenges of balancing a professional career and personal responsibilities. To do this, Heidi set up an office in her bedroom and never missed a beat with her work, even while homeschooling and raising her two young daughters. It's not uncommon to be on a video call with Heidi and watch her expertly nudge a cat off her keyboard or see her daughter uh, is using the jungle gym, <laughs> or using her mother as her jungle gym rather, and even moments later just receive a polished and professional piece of work from Heidi. And on one occasion, despite having finished work for the day, Heidi made time after her kids baseball game and in the late hours of the evening to log back in and perform essential tasks to ensure that filings were completed on time and to the standards of the attorney's office that they always strive to maintain. Heidi's also taken on additional tasks, including creating graphics, responding to increasingly complex grammar requests, and filing briefs with the Supreme Court. She has done all of this from her bedroom office while caring for and educating her children. Heidi, you are awesome. Thank you for being a part of our team. Thank you. I appreciate that. How do you do it? How do you keep yourself going in a year like 2020? Um, it's being flexible and being open to changing how things go and realizing at the end of the day what's important. And the most important thing is that we do the work and that we do good work and that we're being responsive. And that's been our goal the whole year. And also we have a really great team that just focuses on making sure that we have what we need and what's essential and realizing that the other stuff is just noise and we can be gentle with ourselves. We can understand what needs to get done and get those essential things done, but at the same time, uh, take the time that we need to support ourselves mentally and physically and get out of the office. I love that. I'll second that. And as a mother with kids at home, it is hard and loving yourself through all of the challenges and the day-to-day -day work of it all is an incredibly important piece of it that I think as women, especially we, we seldom recognize and, and say out loud. Right. And, but most of it is just being flexible and being open and understanding that um, things are going to be changing and we're not going to know what's going to come and just being willing to tackle whatever it is when it does come. Good job rolling with it, Heidi. So away we go. What are your hopes for this coming year for the city? Um, I would really hope that things will calm down a little bit in our city and that we as citizens and as people can find ways to come together and not let our differences divide us. I think that's been what has been so hard about the last year is that even among city employees and everybody else, we're all people and we all have our own challenges and our own lives that are hard. And so I'm hoping that we can find a way to come together and to do the best work that we can work-wise. I really hope that we can do the best legal work as possible for the city and make sure that we're keeping ourselves in good positions and doing the best work we can. Heidi, thanks for being a leader in Salt Lake City and thanks for making it uh, so fun to talk to you today, but the quality of work has never flagged and we're all grateful for you. Thank you. Well, we have the best team in the city. We really do. We have the best team in any city, anywhere in the US, I think. Amen. Thanks, Heidi. Thanks.